being the Lulu is the Salulu. Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Yeah. Are you getting paid for this? I know that you can't resist music from the water bed. This is what I'm cooking up. <gasps> Marinating some chicken, so getting ready to put it on Ow. the heat. Just look at how nice this blaze is. Blaze. Glazing. If you came from my previous video where I was slaughtering a chicken that is the chicken i'm lying i'm lying i'm lying i don't know if that's the exact chicken There's more than one that was that was being the lulu is the salulu look think about it like this if you have the opportunity which you do have by the way bear this in mind to create any type of world that you want to create for yourself if you want to be a criminal okay you want to not care you want to break the rules and that is the reality that you have chosen that will be the reality that you will have because your actions will lead to the reality that you have right you want to be a successful person you want to live a certain lifestyle you want to be a certain person you will find a way to get there i look at myself now as like a 25 year old person who is just like figuring out that life is is really like supposed to be like not so stressful like it's actually supposed to be fun right and like we're supposed to enjoy existing and every day shouldn't feel like torment every day shouldn't feel like oh i'm trying to get somewhere i'm trying to get somewhere so therefore i can't be happy where i am now because there's always like those pressures of i need to get somewhere also understanding like if you are a spiritual person understanding that things don't happen in your way ever since i started my journey in god I started understanding how much being delusional is the solution. God teaches you to have unwavering faith. Something that you think cannot happen, he can make that thing happen. Things will happen in God's timing, not your timing. And understanding that, we look at ourselves and look at other people. Some people are in a certain position, but you don't know their struggle, their journey, what they went through to get to where they are exactly as well. I think that having a, a lot more grace and, and peace in knowing that there's somebody that is providing good things for you. Nobody can tell me that I'm not what it is that I'm trying to achieve because I'm working towards that, you know? And I think this is the thing about having faith in God and knowing that all you have to do is do. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it drops it. And one thing that I constantly do is build myself up into a state of worry. Like build myself up into a state of like, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh my God, oh my God. Like I have my days where I'm just like, what is going on? All these alarm bells ringing. And there's days where I'm like, I'm chill. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm good. But I also think that comes with like forced maturity. There's so many things that I sit down and I, I question to myself. If I really did the right thing in a situation, if I really like, you know, made the right choices. I, I go through like an internal mental battle at times when it comes to things that are conflicting. And so it's made me understand how much of how much I can create the reality because I can choose to take other people's words and what other people say about me or to me and make that a part of my reality or I can choose that to keep that in their reality. You know what I'm saying? It's like there's this bubble and people are always trying to pop it to add things and you're like, no that can stay over there i like my little bubble here when you have like the power to be able to like separate those things to other people it might seem like you're very unbothered like you don't care like you're whatever but i just i feel like i've learned to compartmentalize things where i understand them and i try not to be driven by emotion too much and this has helped me to create like this delusion that i have that i am capable of a b c d e f g if i just try <laughs> my brain my body my spirit is pushing me to do something or telling me to do something and i always listen to my intuition i'm always like oh what is she saying today she's she's feeling like and then i'll always jump with that I recently saw a video of somebody talking about how you have to act like you are already what you want to be 
right you have to already speak that into your life nothing will make you ever feel as if you are the most knowledgeable on a certain topic or like you are like the teacher of this like you have the most facts that people should listen to you i always feel like that imposter syndrome of i'm making these videos and i'm just blah, 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 blah. but like what makes me qualified to be somebody to come here and, and start telling speaking to people you understand i feel like i give myself a role you understand but that's the, that's all a part of the delusion you have to believe that what you have to say is interesting enough for other people to want to hear it do you understand and if you understand who you are as a person you are made uniquely and you are made with a certain voice a certain mind everybody wants to do youtube these days everybody wants to be an influencer these days it's hard to sit here and just start talking to yourself essentially you understand in your mind you're talking to an audience but essentially you're talking to yourself and you're sitting here and you're feeling confident enough in your words to say i'm gonna come here and share what i have to say with other people that's also what's made me go down this route of being more natural on my youtube channel like not not stressing too much about things like how i look and abc and abc because i wanted to be a bit more of a personal thing you're getting to know me i'm getting to know you let it be more of a community because i feel like that is what i'm doing all of this for i'm living in my future i've wanted to be somebody who can make a community that can gather people together that can provide a positive place a place of happiness laughs you know relatability a place of comfort a place where people can share their ideas and there's no discrimination you know what i'm saying that's a part of what i wanted to do and whether that was through you know my music or art or whatever it is you know i that was my intention especially with my youtube channel our potential should not be wasted you should do whatever you feel like you wanna do putting a bit more of this in this is like chicken spice <laughs> chicken spice and i put a bit of oil in here mm. thank you ma <laughs> a little bit of jerk seasoning oh, a little bit of a little bit of paprika mix her oh i need a bit more wheel if you know what wheel is <gasps> oops <laughs> a bit too much but it's okay it's okay it's okay we like our chicken to be moisturized anyways as we go on to our ad break we are now going to glaze <sighs> yeah boy yeah 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 being delulu is the salula at the end of the day gotta be delusional gotta imagine yourself already living in your dreams and working towards everything that you do regardless of what it looks like to other people because you know how much effort and time and you know work you've put into yourself you know whether whether you need to work harder you know you know whether you need to slow down a little bit you know whether you're doing your best and when you're not doing your best you know at the back of your mind you always know whether you're really doing your best or you're not doing your best you know there's often times when i say to myself i'm doing i'm trying my best and i was not trying my best last year i was saying that i was trying my best i was not trying my best in anything not in my music, not in my YouTube, not in like, I, I just was not trying to, I was feeling exhausted last year. And I just needed to like figure out where I wanted to be in life. And every decision that I made, every choice that I made, you understand, has led me to where I am now. Guys, I always say this, I don't have regrets. No regrets. You understand? None. I mean, I have that. You understand? Like, I mean, I have that. It's your world. Make of it as you will life is so short life is so short just being outside hanging out by the fire smoking up some chicken you know what i mean being content is something that is just difficult i think for people especially nowadays you can see into the lives into the homes of other people and how other people live and you it makes you just think damn so that's how people be living what am i doing and there's like a lot of pressure and that's always the, the thought that i when i hear it i'm like i know where that thought is coming from and i say no to the death what was that psst, psst, psst. is that a cat what is that I think it's a, oh it's a bird blind y'all i can't see she is ultimately being delusional is the way you only have yourself that's holding yourself back.
it's only you people will always be people the world will always continue to do this you know what i'm saying like until the day jesus comes y'all like just do you be happy be free anybody that tries to stop your happiness just give them one slap <laughs> joking i'm joking i'm joking close your eyes and you walk away <laughs> close your eyes and walk away then so don't even don't involve yourself don't involve yourself all right that's just my rant of the day being the lulu is the salulu remember remember it i hope that you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe to comment to like to share you know the vibe